Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and today we're going to be discussing um, the Star Kingdom from the Dragon Prince, and so yeah, let's get into it. So we all know the um, Star Kingdom from the Dragon Prince, it represents the Star Kingdom, represents the Star Magic, it it's on all of the um, Star Touch Elves, like such as Erevos, and probably the other ones. But what is it symbolizing? If you go to the wiki for the Dragon Prince, you know, the wiki, um, you can see that the Star Arcanum symbolizes something long forgotten, like an event long forgotten. And what is this event? Today we're going to be discussing, well, I'm going to be telling you guys, uh, what I think this could have, this event could be. So I think this uh, forgotten event is the planet explosion of Erebos' planet. So if you watched my previous videos, you know I saw a glitched preview of season six, episodes one and two, and I think that um. Well, in, in that glitch preview, um, uh, it showed that Erevos was from a planet um, far, far away in another galaxy, which we can actually see that galaxy in the intro of, of Mystery of Erevos. Um, he's from another planet, a purple planet. And the star Arcanum, and okay, let's, let's just explain, okay, if you haven't seen my other videos. And it has been destroyed by an eight headed void dragon. With the with its beams as well, we can see that in the mystery of Erebos intro. I'm gonna put it up. I'm gonna put up the footage right now of the mystery of Erebos um, intro. One beam strikes the star. The star came symbol, or like the O. Like that's separate. That's so. My theory about that is that it represents the planet. The beam strikes it, and it becomes the star arcanum. That's what I saw in my preview when the void dragon destroyed the planet. It showed, you know, the Star Arcanum. The planet basically turned into a Star Arcanum. Like the explosion, you know. If you know what I'm talking about, you know. So, and also in the in the, in the intro, we see eight beams, if you count them. Um, we do see another one coming out, but that's when the Star Arcanum, you know, like, dims out. Or, like, the beam is not there anymore. So, it's, it's, it's basically eight. So... My theory is that the Star Arcanum alludes to the long-forgotten event of Erebos' purple planet being destroyed. And again, from the glitch preview, Erebos explains, you know, how he got from the asteroid to Earth and all that other stuff that I explained in those videos. Go check them out. So you know. I don't know if you don't want spoilers, but probably, they're probably going to change it, to be honest. So don't get your hopes too up, but... Maybe they'll keep some of this. Who knows? But that's my theory. That the Star Kingdom actually symbolizes Erebos' planet being destroyed by the eight-headed void dragon that I saw in my glitched preview. So, yeah guys, you can disagree, you can agree, but I'm really confident that's what it is. I mean, it's a four-pointed star-looking thing, which we know all explosions, you know, like especially supernova. Sorry for that, uh, that was a little bit of a technical difficulty, but we're back, and so, yeah, so I was gonna say supernovas, um, that are, you know, in the shape of a four-point, I mean, you know how they are, right? They just explode like that. Yeah, that's basically how the Star Kingdom is. And it's a planet, in the middle, the circle represents the planet. So that's basically my point. So yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, and I'll see you in the next video. What are your thoughts about this? Um, do you disagree, agree with me? Um, if the separate symbolizes the planet explosion of Erebus planet, because he's an alien. It's pretty obvious that he's an alien. Um, so yeah, bye.